Hello everyone. I'm so glad you have joined me today. I am going to share another masculine card idea. I challenge myself to use a different set each time I had to do this and I've been able to do it. I've planned out the rest of the month so I will not show you the same set twice. Now what you can do is choose any of the masculine cards I've shared and use the same set over and over and you will have different ideas for them. For today's project, I am going to be featuring the Seaside Bay stamp set. I'm gonna use this one with the shells. I may pull in that one, not positive. And I'm gonna use those cute birds. All right, I'm gonna use gray granite for my birds and crumb cake for the shells and sand. I'm going to add some classic matte dots in the gray. As you can see, I haven't used them much. And then for the card kit, or for the card, you're going to need a piece of white that's five and a half by eight and a half, scored at four and a fourth, a piece of azure afternoon that's four by five and a fourth, a piece of the bright and beautiful DSP that's three and three fourths by five, a piece of crumb cake that's two and three fourths by three and three fourths, and a piece of white that's two and a half by three and a half. Pause the camera, take your picture, and let's craft together. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get rid of all of this and put that up there out of the way, and I'm gonna keep these two pieces down here. This is the first one I'm gonna use, and I'm gonna grab some scrap paper because I know that the birds will go off. And I didn't grab a sentiment, so after I stamp, I'll have to go find a sentiment. I'm gonna take my crumb cake and my sand and shells, and I'm gonna stamp that along the bottom like so, I'll kind of angle it that way so it kind of goes up. Now I need to get that in there and this is when I think I'm gonna pull in that piece so that I fill that in. Um, well, that's not it, there it is. Okay, and I'm just gonna use the same block now, you've got this long piece, so I am not gonna use that. I'm gonna kinda stamp that in there, that up there, that there. Then I'll flip it around and I'll stamp that, that, and I've got just that piece there. So now I've filled in my sand. Um, you don't have to do that if you don't want. I just think it looks better. All right. Um, you know what? I think I'm going to add some sand to the top of this. Let's see how I do this now. All right. If I go... Nope, it won't work because I have to stamp over top the shells. Never mind. Sometimes you have an idea and it just doesn't work. So I'm going to pull in my gray granite. And I'm going to ink up my birds. And these are going to hang off. Hmm. All right. You know what? This isn't going to work. I'm going to have to do one bird at a time. So give me a minute to clean this. Okay. I'm going to use that one bird. So I'm going to use a post-it note. I'm going to ink him up. And I'm going to put him right there and he's up in the air. I got to get the next one down a little bit. All right, so they're walking across. Okay, no big deal. All right, now this is where I need my sentiment. So let me go see if I can find a sentiment. Okay, I'm going to use the block letter hello and I'm going to use my Azure Afternoon marker because I don't have the stamp set. And I am going to, call, or stamp pad I should say. 
I'm gonna color in my sentiment. And when you stamp this, make sure you stamp it the right way. And I'm gonna stamp hello right in the middle, like so. Woo, stuck. There we go. All right, let's get this card put together. All right, so I'm gonna pull in my other pieces here. And all of this gets layered. So I'm gonna start with my card base. I'm gonna fold it on the score line and burnish it. I'm gonna add the Azure Afternoon card stock. Now make sure you check out Vicki's cards. I've seen some of her cards. Oh my gosh, they are adorable. She used ideas I never would have thought of. I've been trying to focus on stamp sets and she's used it with DSP and it's, it's you gotta check her cards out. They're quick and easy and perfect for the guy. All right, and this is going to clog, there it comes. I haven't used this in a while, about a week, because I had the girls here. So, okay, I want it on this way. So I'm gonna add this to my card base. All right. This one goes on next, and it goes on the crumb cake one with some glue. I love it when I can take and use a idea for a quick card. I had Remy up here last night. It was actually sun, a Saturday night because they left Sunday and she wanted to make a bookmark. So we quickly did a bookmark and she's just gotta come to my studio when she comes to visit, which I love. I love crafting with her. All right. She's gonna be my crafter, I think. Um, all right. She has a bunch of stuff on her own. So she comes, she goes and makes cards herself every once in a while. All right, let me take and I send her home with patterned paper, scraps, things like that. She just has a blast. All right, let me put this in the trash and pick up the ones I thought I'd put in the trash but threw on the floor. All right, now this is gonna go on my card and it's gonna go on at an angle like this. Okay, time for our dots, all right. I'm gonna use this one because this one has less on it. So I'm gonna pull off the gray and I am gonna bring some down here close to the birds so that gray pulls them out and puts it all together. And there we have our quick and easy masculine card. And I carried the theme to the inside using those cute, and I forgot to stamp those, so I've got to do that before I take my picture. Cute birds and those shells. Thanks for watching. I appreciate your visiting me, and I hope I've inspired you with some ideas. If you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe using the button below so that you get notified when I upload car, um, a new video. And if you're not new and you haven't subscribed, I would love it if you would do that. I love sharing my ideas with you and inspiring you. And I hope I encourage you with my cards to go try some stamping. Thanks for dropping by. Have a great day. Bye.